Let's go. Football is back, baby. Football is finally back. The Seahawks are finally playing on Sunday. I'm excited. I'm excited for the season to start tonight. I'm recording the audio before the Lions vs. Chiefs game. And then I'm going to finish editing this video after the game. And the video should be out after the game. But we're going to talk about the most important game of the week. The Rams come into town to play the Seahawks in week one. And it's going to be an easy fucking W. No Cooper Cup. Might as well just chop it up as a W for us. But before we get into the pregame analysis, let's talk about the injury report. We're going to talk about the Rams first because their injury report is not as long as the Seahawks is. So they got three players on their injury report. They got Stetson Bennett out with a uh, right shoulder injury. Cooper Cup obviously is out with a hamstring injury. And Hunter Long is out or questionable with a uh, thigh injury. So not too many players on their injury report, but they don't have many good players on their roster in the first place. Now for the Seahawks injury report, Kenny McIntosh and Jamal Adams did not participate. And then in the limited participation, we had Derek Hall, Mike Morris, Darrell Taylor, Devin Witherspoon. And then for full participation, we actually had JSN. P. Carroll actually came out and said that he is going to play in week one. So I'm excited to see him in regular season form. And Cody Thompson was also a full participant in practice. Now, I don't expect for Jamal Adams and Devin Witherspoon to play. I expect Witherspoon to play week two, probably. He's been dealing with a hamstring injury during training camp. So no need to rush him back, especially when we're playing such a depleted Rams team. It's definitely going to be a challenge for him coming back in week two, going against St. Brown. Okay, so lastly, for the pregame analysis... I think it's going to be a pretty easy W for the Seahawks. We're opening up this season at home. I think the stadium is going to be loud. I don't think this game is going to be close at all. Might win by two or three touchdowns even. I think Geno's going to cook. I think K-9 is going to cook. The whole receiving core is going to cook because we got the big three. That's what we're going to call them this season. The big three. We got DK, Lockett, and JSN. All of them are going to go off. The only person you need to watch out for on the Rams defense is Aaron Donald. He is a wrecking force. We know that. We've seen that for the past decade. But he's aging. And he's the only one on the lineman that would cause any type of ruckus. I have no idea how Matthew Stafford is going to look. I haven't seen any videos of him in training camp. No reports or anything. So we're going to see how he's looked since his last injury. He's definitely going to struggle with no Cooper Cup. The Seahawks defense are probably going to look good this week. But if the Seahawks defense looks good this week, I'm not going to get my hopes up. I'm going to need to see it for more weeks to believe it. I still think we got an average defense. But the defense is better than last year. And that's all I can ask for. Because last year... The defense was pitiful. So I'm feeling pretty confident. I'm going to say we'll win this game 35 to 17 or 31 to 17. Either way, I think it's going to be a blowout. I don't think we're going to have a heart attack as Seahawks fans watching this game. But then again, the Seahawks will always find a way to still make it a game that will give you a heart attack. So will I be surprised if it's a close game and we need Geno to pull off a fourth quarter comeback? No, I will not be because it would be the most Seahawks thing to do. But I'm going to pick the Seahawks to win this game. I had us winning this game in my season prediction video, and I'm not going to switch up on that now. The Seahawks are going to start off this season 1-0. and And yeah, thank you guys for watching to the end of this video. I really appreciate it. Let me know in the comments below who you guys think are going to win this game. Give this video a thumbs up if you like the video. And subscribe to the channel for more Seahawks and Lakers videos like this. And turn post notifications on. And I hope you all have a great rest of the day or night. And I'm out, man. Peace.